and welcome to ET Now. You're watching this very special series, Super Achievers Making New India, powered by Voice Vault. I'm Pooja Jain, and we're putting the spotlight on two super achievers tonight. First up, Astrum, one of India's leading building material manufacturers. Astral Limited is one of India's leading building materials companies. Astral started its journey with the manufacturing of polymer pipes and went on to diversify into other building material categories like adhesives, water tanks, sanitary ware, faucets and paints. Quality and innovation in B2B categories have been core competencies of Astral, backed with a reliable and trusted brand name that covers the needs of millions of households across the country and overseas. Help me to better understand how innovation has become such a central component of Astral's DNA and what are perhaps some future planned innovations in the pipeline that you can tell me more about. See, we started off Astral with innovation. We were the first one to bring CPVC to this part of the globe. Right. And at that time, uh, nobody knew the polymer. The polymer was uh, something used in the developed countries, had a lot of attributes. So Astral basically started with innovation. And then we were the first one to ever bring a lead-free PVC. The people were surprised that how this product would work. And today the whole country, even the government has banned use of lead in the right. plastics. Similarly, we were the innovators for CPVC, aluminum CPVC pipe. And we were the first one globally to have commercial manufacture return in India. Absolutely. We also brought in recently a silent pipe from technology from Germany. Except a few companies, we are the first one to make this product on this side of the globe. We have recently worked and developed a PP multi-layer pipe, which is also a very innovative product and globally it has come for the first time. So Astral has always been innovating products, whether it is the pipes and now in the adhesives. We are the first one to bring Bontide Pro. Globally, it's a very innovative product. And with this, uh, our DNA or our, our journey is always on innovation. Right. With innovation, we look at the affordability of the Indian customer. So we bring products, we check with people that it is affordable, it replaces something which has been conventional. And these products make the infrastructure of India way ahead and in competition with the global developed countries. Well, let me build on that with a follow-up question because I really love your take on the implementation of Bureau India standard norms within the PVC space and how do you believe that as a result the industry stands to benefit at large? The, I can say the industry will benefit but the customers will benefit. The main help of these standards is for the customers. Because a lot of things happen around the polymer today without the ISI mark, which is not there in many of the products. Yes. Uh, if it is compulsory, the customer will benefit a lot. So making standards throughout all the systems used in either plumbing or agriculture site in piping or the distribution of water for the project of gel signal, yes. everything will help uh, to give the right product and right system and deliver a good uh, product to the consumer. Of course. The low level consumer needs these things. Well sir, you know Astral is really enjoying a phenomenal uh, compounded annual growth rate of I think in the order of 20%. Uh, I'd love to understand your approach to attaining and retaining top talent in this market. See, top talent to retain is the toughest thing for any enterprise and uh, manpower is the key after certain level of growth. Brand, brand is there, branding is done, you have network, but your manpower is yeah. the, the core of human who, yeah, human capital. So we are investing on them. We, are, we have an ESOP program also in place. We are extending that ESOP program. That's uh, one of the uh, key programs which we run and this year we have decided to extend the program to all the key people and at the same time we remain directly in uh, touch with all the top manpower key 
one-to-one -one relationship right. and discuss with them their issues and what, at all level. And uh, I am approachable. We are approachable by anyone if he has open a door policy. Yeah, open door policy. But I think the the biggest challenge we are discussing only yesterday is is human. Now. You want to grow so much, but you need talent to grow. Absolutely. And so now, uh, by way of closing comments, a question on many people's minds: uh, When can we expect Astral to become a ten thousand crore top line company? See, we have been growing at uh, a good pace in these last two years uh, in the COVID era. We were, we were concerned about the growth, but we have overgrown in COVID era. So we at least focused to grow around 15 to 20 percent. And the new business is like the paints which we have entered, we still need to bring it to Pan India base, so would give us higher growth. Faucets and ceramic ware, once they start rolling out in the market, we have just started uh, selling them a few weeks back right. from the state of Gujarat. Once they are at Pan India level in next fiscal, will give us a good number. Adhesive is actually growing at a fast pace, especially the, the construction chemicals we are focused to make it grow. And obviously the pipe business is growing. So uh, I would feel that we should be 10,000 plus in next uh, four to five years. That's my focus. Well, sir, we certainly look forward to that and we look forward to next steps that lie ahead with this company as it ushers in a new era of growth. Oh, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Sir, so Astral has always been admired as a company that exercises strong financial discipline. And that reflects in its working capital, that reflects in its you know, return on capital ratios. How challenging is it to maintain that standard in the current environment? Yeah, you rightly said, particularly in the piping industry, to maintain these kind of discipline is always tough. But in our organization, we have educated every our senior that with the growth, these disciplines are equally important. If you are growing fast and if you are not maintaining the discipline, you are going to fall. And there are so many examples available in India. So many companies were growing fast and they sharply collapsed also. So we don't want that to happen. That's why we always say that grow little less. Sure. But at least you should have a discipline. So that's why we always do our 100% business through a distribution network. And that's why we are able to maintain that discipline. Well, sir, speaking of growth, right, I think that Astral has enjoyed tremendous growth from an industry expansion perspective. Right? What was once a piping company is now you know, a building materials company. So how bullish are you on both the company's prospects and the sector's prospects in the next three to five year time horizon? So I think building material is always the evergreen sector. If you see the last 20 years of India journey, the building industry has always delivered the growth. Right. Any industry or any, you can say the country want to grow at a six, seven percent GDP growth, Without the support of construction industry or a building material, it is not possible. Because building material consists of close to about 225 different products. So if this is not going to grow, I don't think India will grow. So we are very clear that this industry has a still potential to grow another 20 years. Because India needs millions of houses. Today, the way you see the culture is getting changed. Earlier, we were staying with our grandparent, father, mother. Now, completely a nuclear concept is coming. Right. So, with this, you need more and more houses. So, building material industry has to perform. And secondly, our economy is also performing. So, aspiration level is going high. When I was young, we were not even dreaming for the home. But now, the kids are getting educated and they are doing the first job itself. In one or two years or three years, they are starting the planning of the house. So that is the difference. So because of that, I think this industry has to grow. And without that, India can't grow. Well, sir, you know, by way of closing comments, if we take a look at the very healthy balance sheet of Astral and the amount of cash reserves, I have to ask, you know, what is the acquisition strategy of the company? And are there any promising acquisitions in the pipeline that you can tell us more about? So I think Astral is known for the acquisition. So in my journey with this group, we have done five, six acquisitions. Yes. So we are always open-minded for the acquisition. Any product or any company which is fitted to this principle, which I explained you, ROC and synergy with the brand and all the things, we are always open to do the acquisition. But I think now recently 
we have done little higher than what we were originally planning. So we enter into sanitary wear, faucet, paint, tank, everything has come together. Right. So I think next three years, at least we are not looking for the new acquisition, but we will try to consolidate what we are having. You know, today we are having the opportunity of 1,50,000 crore market opportunity in the segment in which we have entered. Right. Again, that our company has delivered only 4,400. So practically you can say we are a 3% of the opportunity in right. India. So right. enough room is available for us for the next five year growth. So we will keep a stop right now for the acquisition for next three years. And then we will see that whatever is suitable to the organization, whatever the board take a decision, we will follow that and we'll do more acquisition. Well, sir, we congratulate you and the larger team on all your success and we look forward to continuing to track the company's journey. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you.